Yeah. 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 Yeah.
right, so the throttle position needs to be adjusted. It does nothing right at the beginning. Later on, I found out that the car is actually in limp mode, and the reason why it's in limp mode is because there's something wrong with the throttle body, and come to find out that one of my plugs, the pins to the plug was actually sticking. They weren't, like, in the plug, so what I did just push them back in there and straighten them out and plugged it back up, and the car just went back to normal. So it stopped jerking and actually had full throttle response. Also, we forgot to plug in one of my transmission sensors, so it kind of struggles to get in the fifth gear when you're cruising. And I want to shift into the next gear. I believe that's because the, it's still setting uh, sport mode, probably. But I don't have the button down there to click on it. It's probably in the trunk or whatever. Right after we got done with the test drive, I had drove the car home, and then for the next few days, I kind of just drove the car here and there to figure out the little bugs and figure out, you know, why it's in limp mode and stuff like that. But overall, it feels great to finally be able to drive my car again. After seeing it just sitting around for so long, it's kind of getting a, a little annoying. But got it back on the road. It's driving fine. And shout out to my Uncle Lee. He was the one that had allowed us to use his flatbed, and he told my car to my Uncle Ron's house so that we could put it on his lift. And shout out to Uncle Ron for allowing us to use his lift and for him helping us, you know, put the transmission in and out. And as well, shout out to my cousin Corey who is Fast Life, you know, one, two, three. That's his channel, I have that in the description below. And if it wasn't for their help, it would probably been a real struggle trying to get this transmission in, in and out the car because doing it on the ground is something serious. With that said, make sure you guys subscribe to my channel because I have more content coming for the IS, including my next video will be a drive-by wire delete. So stay tuned for that and I'll see you guys in the next video.